how much money do extras actually make? Hi, my name is Belgica and I'm an actress in the San Francisco Bay Area and I make acting related videos every Monday and Thursday. I talk about how to find auditions, where to find them, how to self -tape, how to film self-tape auditions and lots, lots more. So if you're into that, subscribe right now. Today I wanted to talk about how much money extras actually make. Um, because you can make a decent amount, but it would take a long, long time. I've been an extra on stuff for my friend, like a really ultra low budget film, which means I think a quarter million or less. And I've been an extra on big TV shows and movies. So here in the Bay Area, um, SAG-AFTRA has to pay at least minimum. So in the shows that I've been an extra in, the bigger shows, it's $13.25 an hour. And uh, that's usually $106 for about eight hours, but you do get taxed on it. So it'll be a little bit less than that, depending on whatever your living situation is, if you're married, if you have kids, all of that. Um, and that is for non-union actors. Right now I'm a non-union actress. And uh, for union people, I think it's a little bit closer to 140, but you can make more um, than just that per day because you can get a fee for your bringing your own clothing. You can get a fee for getting fed late. If you bring your dog, if they ask you, of course, or if they ask you to bring your um, skateboard or your car, you can get a fee, an additional fee to that base um, per hourly rate. So you can make a lot more money than that. The most I have been able to make in one day being an extra was uh, just under $200 after taxes and that was from being on set for 16 hours. So you can make a decent amount of money being an extra if you go and, and you're an extra for lots of days in a row for um, long, long hour days. So that's the answer. You make around a hundred to two hundred dollars, depending on how much, how long you're there. I would say if you're not in the Bay Area and you're and you're not in California, it's uh if it's a big budget SAG after film union film then they are legally obligated to pay you at least minimum wage. Um, if they're really desperate and you're non-union, they might give you a voucher and they might pay you um, a little bit more money just because they want to entice people to come and they're going to feed you. So, you know, you can kind of say that that's like a form of payment. But if you're an extra in like a low budget film or an ultra low budget film like I was for my friend, then you can make nothing. <laughs> I've also been, been an extra on some independent stuff where I made like $50 to $100 for the day. It just really depends. But um, yeah, not that much money. It, it, it of course accumulates if you're an extra a bunch of days in a row, but that's how much extras make. Um, I feature somebody in, at the end of every video and today I wanted to feature Bethany. She makes art tutorials. If you would like to be featured, make sure you subscribe, like this video and comment below. Thanks so much for watching.